shortly the government of Sudan is going to put an end to this rebellion and uh, I assure them that we are keen for the stability, the peace uh, in the region. But more importantly, I explain that uh, all authorities or countries or media should distinguish between the legal authority in Sudan and the rebels. They, they, these two should not be equated to each other. Ethiopia received Thursday an envoy for Sudanese General Abdel Fatal Al Burhan to discuss the ongoing conflict amid reports of continuing violence in Khartoum. The special envoy said that the Sudanese government would soon put an end to the conflict. Shortly, the government of Sudan is going to put an end to this rebellion. I assured them that we are keen for stability, the peace in the region. But more importantly, I explained that all authorities, countries, media should distinguish between the legal authority in Sudan and the rebels. These two should not be equaled to each other, said the Falah al Hajj, special envoy of Sudanese General Abdel Fatal al Burhan. Speaking in the Ethiopian capital Addis Ababa, the Sudanese special envoy urged the rebels to put down arms. The other rebellion, I would say, they are still raising up arms, fighting, and they didn't show any consent to heal or to give up. And we have announced more than one time that there is still a chance to pardon whoever is ready to put down arms, said Sudanese special envoy. Violence erupted on April 15th, preceded by months of escalating tensions between the military led by General Abdel Fatal al Burhan and a rival paramilitary group called Rapid Support Forces, or RSF, commanded by General Mohamed Hamdan Dagro. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.